our next reader tonight is Diane Grable. I've had the privilege of meeting Diane Grable in two places here recently. Um, a couple months ago, I first met her reading up at Warrensburg at the Old Drum Open Mic series that they have every Thursday night, uh, every first Thursday night of the month from 6 to 8 o'clock. In fact, this week is, is going to be Old Drum Open Mic at the Tranquility Shop on Holden Street in downtown Warrensburg. If you uh, care for even you know, some more of this kind of thing, it's always a good program and, and great folks. I heard Diane read there. And I was talking about the class I was going to have, Poem and You, and she asked me about it afterwards and ended up uh, joining us for that. So uh, I've enjoyed getting to know Diane better. Diane is primarily a writer of prose. In fact, she's recently published four books, a couple study books, one a book of Christian-based fiction, and a children's book. And she recently enjoyed a book signing at Reader's World here in Sedalia. Diane's originally from Sedalia. She's lived in Green Ridge for the past six years. And so I welcome for another first time reader, Diane Grable. My first poem, well, I wrote in the class and uh, I wrote it, I didn't tell them in the class because I didn't want everybody to know this, but anyway, <laughs> uh, my daughter had kind of casually mentioned she thought her daughter was sneaking out, so this poem was written because of that. It says, um, I wanted to run and do my own thing. Young, beautiful, and full of vitality, I wanted to run and do my own thing. Stubborn, obstinate, and determined, I wanted to run and do my own thing. I snuck out, met him in the bar. I wanted to run and do my own thing. He was old and wiser too. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Take a drink, one won't hurt. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Smoke the cigarette, it can't hurt. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Drink after drink, I was hooked. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Wake to drink and drink to sleep. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Snort some coke. Everyone does it. Does it. Does it. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Flying higher, snorting more. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Hooked on drink, stuck on coke. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Hey now, coke's not free. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Flop in the bed, roll over again. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Stand, wait for the man to come around. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Beat to a pulp. Can't take much more. Didn't earn enough. I wanted to run and do my own thing. I'm bleeding, dying. Who really cares? Prostitute, druggy alky. Just wanted to run and do my own thing. Writing to you, listen, please. This life is not what it's made out to be. Sneaking out the window, wanting to run, do my own thing. Pay attention to your mom. Pay attention to me. Listen intently, if you please. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Sneaking out at 12, pimped at 13, dying at 14. I wanted to run and do my own thing. Can't run, can't walk, can't even get off the sidewalk. Bleeding, dying, and desperately crying. Can't run or do my own thing. And this, in, this next, next one is insignificant not. And I, I believe none of us is, is insignificant. Because I am a snowflake. Seemingly insignificant, I stand and I wait, waiting patiently until my master says fall. Then I fall. Fall to the ground, fall all alone. Me, myself, and I, I fall. Insignificant? No. Mm -mm. My points are unique. 
There's only one me compared to no one. Alone I fall, swiftly floating, gaining speed, I fall. Alone I'm weak, joined I'm, I'm strong. Connected to others, I form a bond. Together we cover mountains, valleys, and plains, everything covered. We blanket the earth, shimmering diamonds, glistening snow, made into snowballs, snow forts, and snowmen. What good are we? We cover the earth with nutrients, saturate it with moisture, fun for some and fear for others. I am a snowflake, insignificant, not. Different, important, insignificant, not. Okay. And this next one I've, I've got is who will help them? Yesterday, I saw hungry kids. Today, they're dead. Anorexica, the mortician said. Starvation, I fear I dread. Kids living in streets. No one to love them, no one to care. Pimp on the corner offering food, clothing, money. What does it matter? No one cares. Kids hurting, crying, alone and cold. Nowhere to go, no one to care. Who will help them? Who even cares? Street kids, dumped, rejected, alone. Nowhere to go, no one to care. Who will help them? Who even cares? Thank you.